What is going on, Sheep Army? This is your boy Random Marks coming with a quick video. And on this video, guys, we're gonna be talking about Shibarium's competing layer two by the name of Ryoshi, guys. So, so it is the name is called Ryoshi Layer Two. And I know what some of you guys might be thinking, like, oh my god, another layer two that's competing against Shibarium. So it's not what you think. So make sure you watch this video all the way to the end, as well as hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. I definitely love to hear you guys' thoughts and opinion about Shiba Inu. So when it comes to the Sheep Army, and I've made this video countless times again before, as far as letting you guys know, when it comes to the division within the army, um, it's typically stemming from people who, again, got in into uh, Shiba Inu after October, which is now pretty much the majority of the people that's in it. You know, I'm still in it and I got in way over here. Um, but majority of the people that got in, they got in, you know, during this run up right here. So, of course, a lot of people are angry. They're holding the bag. Um, they're looking for solutions. And one of the solutions that most people think, you know, in a short term standpoint, they think burns. Burns will not affect Shiba Inu short term. It's more of a long term thing. Hence why I really don't care much about burns. Um, and I've always said, said that before, like, I, I don't care about burns. Is it good? Absolutely. Do I think it's like a, a deal breaker for me? No, it's not. Because I feel like Shiba Inu has way more to offer than just burning some tokens. And that's just my opinion. Some people may disagree. I mean, which is fine. But that's, again, that's just from my standpoint. Now, as a developer, on the other hand, and if I'm building a product, I think I would go based upon what the masses are saying. Um, Shiba Inu, it's almost like a, a, a two-edged sword or double-edged sword you know on the positive side we have degens you know they're just like crazy about shiba inu on the other side we have degens who don't understand investment don't understand um uh, investing um and don't understand long term because everything has to happen right now right now right now right now right now or they're gonna get mad so i think with this new layer two what's well, not again it's not really new this was she uh sheep chain and i made a video about them let me see here I made the video about them uh when was this Oh, three weeks ago okay so i made a video about them three weeks ago and it seems like things are longer when it comes to crypto but saying how they're going to be competing against shibarium and essentially that's what they're doing and i even you know sheep chain at the time of this video i was saying that they were battling against sheep association because sheep association was like hey we thought of the name sheep chain first and they came out of nowhere and stole it which i said was pretty much bs because there's already uh you know a sheep chain that's been out for over a year or so so i don't know if they heard my video but they decided that they wanted to rebrand so now it's called ryoshi l2 so this is some of the stuff that they have to offer. And again, it's not going to be an easy task for them. I'm just going to automatically just put that out. But I definitely want them to succeed. Because if you have more options in the market, then in my opinion, it is going to make developers on Shibarium side, you know, step their game up. Not saying that they're not stepping their game up, but it's, it's going to make them uh, be a little bit more weary as far as like, hey, they're doing this. They're guarding this attention from the Sheep Army. So let me go ahead and try to do it. It's pretty much, it's going to fuel innovation. That, that's the word I'm, I'm searching for, innovation. Because they're going to be competing. Things could compete, and, but still be friendly. Because in our case, it's just competing layer twos, but at the end of the day, it's still going to be serving Shiba Inu. And, and this is one thing I can't stand. And then the people that goes, you know, start bashing Shibarium, you know, try to say, hey, come over here. Like, that's not what it's about. Because if both of them succeed, the end goal is to help Sh uh, Shiba Inu price, right? If that's the end goal, then why not want to see Shibarium succeed? Why not want to see uh, Ryoshi layer two succeed? As long as they're doing everything correctly, as far as like not scamming and stuff like that, I want to see them succeed. Because now the holders, we have different options. We have new developers, they have different options. And the more options that you get for, you know, that's available, the more and more inclined people are going to be to be able to try to innovate or try to be able to garner that attention. So looking at it from the standpoint, as far as for an investor, one thing that I could say for sure, um, when it comes to for Ryoshi, um, they're new. A lot of people don't know who they are. And some might say, well, people don't know who uh, Shaitoshi is, but the fact of the matter, Shaitoshi been around since 2021, it's 2024. And Whatever people might say, whatever he says he's going to do, he actually comes through and do it. So people are more likely to trust Saitoshi or Shibarium side um, versus a new chain that's popping up where they have to prove themselves. I mean, at the end of the day, this is crypto. This is people's investment that's, uh, that they're investing. So the trust has to be earned. You know, no sugar coating. The trust has to be oh, earned. But I do see ways where they could actually gather the attention of the sheep army. And I think they're doing a pretty good job as far as marketing it that way, which is the burns. Again, for someone who cares nothing about burns, you know, I think the job that they're doing as far as, again, for marketing is wonderful. Because October, that's majority of the army. Like, this is where, this is the only thing that people ever know. Like, burn, 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 even though it wasn't the case before then. So they could capture a lot of the sheep army. But on the other coin, you have, you know, the majority of the army are degens. Because if, if they were, like, savvy... And, and I'm not saying it's like everybody in the army. I'm just saying, like, because I'm a degen, but I also, you know, respect investing, like, strategies and stuff like that. But a prime example, Bone. Bone only have 95,000 holders. 95,000 holders. So that means the Sheep army in itself, they don't really go out and, 
invest outside of sheep majority of them because bone in itself is helping sheep but they're not doing anything about it to be able to help themselves they're just wanting to see their bag just pump if it's not it's everything is price action you know is it affecting sheep so even having a layer two right now that's going to be for uh for sheep they may not even try to participate in it and that's just the sad reality of it, it you know the good thing about the sheep army again is that hey die hard they you know they like to the fomo in the stuff but the bad part about it they're degens they don't really understand as far as like long term of investing so with that because it's because another thing that i look at it too with, uh, with ryoshi l2 is that they're going to need validators right on their uh, layer two what's going to be the incentive to bring validators over is it just going to be you know through the transactions where that's going to get over to the validators or are they going to create another token because doing all of this is not cheap and i think typically it's the latter because that's what that's what most people do like to, just to be able to get more people onto the chain got to give them some type of reward so and this is some part that people try to criticize uh shibarium and all the, uh, you know shibarium and shaitoshi they're like oh they're just gonna you know trying to steal more money from the community blah 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 um but at the end of the day like where is the funds gonna be coming from you know so more likely a token has to be created and that is going to be the reward token so it's pretty much going to be the same thing um all over again but then you're looking to try to get the support from the sheep army but i think it could work overall it is going to be an uphill battle um they have my support of course because if anything is dealing with shiba inu and it's something positive not scamming people and stuff like that always have my support so this is how they uh this is the test right here of how uh ryoshi looks so they're using a polygon zk evm model and they got their you know rpc for their bridge and here's the bridge uh, contract so shibarium got another competition i said i was gonna you know make another video too about this uh, once i got more word and according to shibarium gym i don't know if i told you guys this already but this is set to launch in february and the last suggestion that i would definitely have for them so if they're watching this is definitely consider having a bridge mechanism from the two layer twos from shibarium all uh, over to uh, ryoshi the reason why this would be advantageous uh to ryoshi is it's gonna it's gonna do two things or really three things whatever project that's on shibarium this is gonna give them the opportunity to be able to have a project onto yours so this is adding more um lp um or tvl onto ryoshi not only that you know the transaction so having separate liquidity pool so if it's if the price is up on over here guess what people are going to do they're going to bridge over to shibarium and buy it up over here which would eventually make the price go up or if the price is you know down over here bridge over and sell it over here which is going to cost more transaction between the two chain so holders are going to be happy more usage on the uh on the, the two different layer twos and not only that it's going to help the overall goal if the overall goal is to burn sheep then this is going to do it as far as more transaction and it's going to help the traction of your platform a lot faster and the last thing that i think is very very imperative um, that they do is to also have an official bone token as well as an official uh leash token because despite what people might say the world view as it currently stands right now bone is a part of the ecosystem leash is a part of the ecosystem the powers that be which is the exchanges which is the you know institution they view bone leash and shiba inu all a part of the ecosystem because you'll get articles from coindesk which is like one of the top um news outlet when it comes to crypto mention that you have exchanges like crypto.com that already views it like that because the thing that you don't want to do to shoot yourself in the foot is by letting a fraudster come onto your chain and let them create a bone let them create a leash token and something end up happening to where the funds of you know the people then they're just going to label the whole chain as a fraud so again these are just my unsolicited advice and based upon what i'm seeing um and based upon trends of how blockchain it is going to require money like i mentioned before so more likely they are going to create a new token um to be able to um to be able to raise the funds as well as uh, giving these validators and delegators some a carrot to be able to be on this layer two but let me know guys in the comment down below again i'm extremely bullish about this about both uh layer twos i want to see them succeed um and hence why i'm even making this video just to say you know my two cents on all of it shibarium continue to do what you're doing ryoshi you're new to the game as far as uh from from the standpoint of the army so trust would have to be uh you know trust is going to be a, a big factor into this but leave a comment down below guys your thoughts your opinion about all this random art signing off peace